Scene one, Apple take two. There's a scene where I, I warm some butter in my hand and, and I act like it's nothing. Well, there is nothing better than some hot bread and butter. Yeah. Here you go. Did you just warm this butter up for me? Yeah. That's really nice. <laughs> oh. That's just what you do. And I've never seen anyone do it. I wish I had a concept of that kindness. You know what I mean? I'd be like, do you want some butter? Really hitting that bread. <laughs> My favorite scene to film was in the restaurant. Not because of the story, but the lovely, lovely, sweet folks that were, you know, hired to be diners talked through the whole, <laughs> talked through the whole scene as if they had paid admission, but were like, what's happening? You talk and I'll talk at the volume that they were talking. Okay, sure. Okay. Oh, do you, have you been? <laughs> it would be okay. just enough to know that it wasn't a whisper, but not enough to know what was said. Yeah. Just like a couple, <laughs> a couple of the extras were like so old. One of them is like wearing like a babushka. It looks like she was probably in Yentl, didn't change out of her <laughs> costume from when she shot that, hung around New York until someone was like, you're needed on set again. She was like, okay. Action. <laughs> Cut. Hey, what's up everyone? Lisa here with another Hollywood update. Kevin Costner is in negotiations to star in Criminal for Millennium Entertainment and New Image Films with Ariel Vroman attached to direct. Next up, Dylan Barker has joined the growing cast of Paramount Pictures' Martin Luther King Jr. biopic, Selma, portraying FBI chief J. Edgar Hoover. That's all for today. Remember to keep it tuned to our channel for all the latest releases and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.